two, two one. one, and we, we are live. live! Hi guys! Hello everybody, welcome back to another, back at it again with, with another, another video. video. Welcome, welcome to back. Honky Tonk Recovery. Honky Tonking Recovery. Honky Tonking. <gasps> we Hon got told today that you can say you're going honky tonking. Yeah, like you can use it as... What is it? The verb. describing word. Yeah. Uh, the verb. And a noun. And as a noun. Yeah. Going to a honky tonk. Honky tonking. So good. Oh, it's just fantastic. Hello, everyone. Thanks Hi. for being here, you guys. How's everyone doing? Like, this, people have been worried about us because we've just been a bit quiet. Yeah. We've been a bit quiet whilst we've been out partying. And you know what? I just feel like, yeah, we have been quiet. Yeah. But but not for the reasons people said. People were like, I bet they were really hungover today because they've been quiet online. No, we've been out oh all gosh. day. We literally woke up. You woke up at like six. Oh my gosh, it was awful. It was like we've had a full day and we've been <laughs> out on a bus tour. We'll tell you more about all that later. But we've yeah. been out all day today. So we just haven't had time to post on Instagram. Really. Exactly. Um, it's basically that. But yes, we did have a few drinks last night. Yes, we did yes, we go to did. multiple honky tonks. Yes, we did make friends with some Americans from Kansas who bought us shots. Oh my gosh, they've got people in the bar from Kansas. Hysterical. Like, they were so funny. They were hilarious. They were, they, they were so drunk, they thought I was Adele. Yeah. They were just hilarious. I got a picture of all, all five, one, two, three, four, five of us. That's so and funny. And also, they don't even like... They have no idea that we are like Joel and Leah. We have a little channel together. They've got no idea. They just think we're two randoms. Like we didn't really go yeah. into detail, and we didn't get the numbers. And yeah, hysterical. It's so funny. They'll never know. They were like, "You were our highlight." Know. We were like, "Thanks." They were guys. like, "I don't. I want, don't want to lose contact with you guys. Can we get you on Snapchat?" We we're like, "We're not we don't on have Snapchat." Snapchat. And they were like, "What about Facebook?" We we're like, we're "Hardly not really check on it. Facebook." And then they were like, "We don't have Instagram," and we we're like, "Okay, oh, well, okay. tonight is goodbye." Goodbye. Goodbye, millions. Millions. Yeah, they were really funny. Yeah. Um, oh, cool. Um, okay. Do you know what? Before we get going, Joel, let's just thank Meredith over here. Hi, Hi Meredith. Meredith. Um, please give Oklahoma Air a medal. They posted that they made it on time and were early. Well. Well. That is brilliant. Thank you for getting here early. Any Thank legend you. who gets here early deserves a medal. Medals for all the legends who came here for front row seats. Medals. And as and Katie Scoot said, yeah. a legend never misses a live stream. Yeah, thanks to Scoot for like honestly like switching between the CMAs and watching the Joel yeah. and Leah live. Like that's commitment. This is the Joel and Leah Awards. This is the Joel and Leah Awards. We're gonna be giving out we're medals giving out to medals. the legends tonight. Yeah. But yeah, like the CMAs are on up the road here, we're, like Crazy. walking past it. Oh, we just told some women, we're like, you all look gorgeous girls. Yeah, they were amazing. Stunning. stunning tonight. Yeah, the vibes are lit in Nashville. And apparently, the, on the bus tour, they were saying tonight is the night to go celeb spotting. Yeah. Because after the award ceremony, who's to say that loads of these celebs won't be going out and... Honky tonking. Honky tonking, basically. Yeah, there'll so, be so many girls out tonight just trying to, like, honky tonk. Yeah, just trying to honky tonk themselves a boyfriend. Yeah. Um, I mean, I should technically be out there honky tonking myself, you know, a partner, you know, but am I going to? Honky tonk a country star. No, I want, I've got my own live show. It's like we were walking past all these people going into the CMAs and we were like, sorry, we've got our own live show yeah, later. Yeah, we've got to do our own show, For actually. our legends. Me legends. Me legends. Yes, yeah, so that's what, um, that's what we were thinking earlier. Yeah. Thank you, Meredith. Thank and you, also Meredith. thank you, Kelly Morgan. Oh, Kels, Kelly Morgan. how are you? Hey there. Joel, hope you got to see Lauren D on the red carpet and that Fletcher's pizza was nearby. Well, I didn't. I only just discovered today that Lauren Daigle was presenting an award. But no, we didn't even know where the red carpet was because we didn't arrive back until later. And then we were filming a hot chicken video and then we went for dinner. So yeah. we basically missed all of the red carpet. I don't know where it was even. Yeah, and like this morning when we were walking to the Hop On Hop Off bus tour, we noticed that they'd like taken down all the equipment and the stage for GMA. Yeah. So we were like, oh, that was taking like two days to put up. And then they just like, obviously did the good morning show and then they put it all down. Mm. We were like, oh, that's that's over and done with. Yeah. So yeah, no celebrity, no celebrity sightings today. The only thing is, because I think we live right near it, yeah. but we never saw a red carpet be set up. So I don't know yeah. where it was. Um, but also, even if we were there, 
Like it would take out so much time of filming. Like we filmed what three or four videos today. We did three today. Three today, and I, we probably would have done one if we'd done celeb spotting. So I would have loved that, but also no. what's hilarious is that we don't know enough of the country stars to really do the celeb spotting. Yeah. So we'd have just been like sheep following the crowd because there's like people hanging out in certain areas, doing you know waiting, yeah. waiting, waiting, waiting for signings. From what I've seen, we literally only know Jennifer Hudson and Nicole Kidman and Lauren Daigle. And yeah. That's about it. Who so else everyone is, else would have been We a don't bit. know if Taylor's there. We don't know if Miley's there. Like, we just don't know. We just don't know. And I don't think they are. But they could be. But from what I've seen on the red carpet photos, I'm yeah. pretty sure if Taylor or Miley were there, they'd be on the websites so as, like, on the red carpet. Yeah. And I haven't seen them, so... Okay. Well, we've done the digging, guys. Anyway, should we tell you about our lovely day? Yeah. Um, it was really nice. Other than the early wake-up. Or should we tell you about the honky-tonk last night? Oh, yeah, let's start with the honky-tonk last night because so... lots of legends donated Super Chats for our drinks. Oh, my God. And we started off the evening with a bushwhacker. Yeah. And oh my goodness, it's like a dessert. It was really nice, you know. I love the, I love peanut butter in drinks. Yeah. So like to have peanut butter in a boozy drink, I was like, yeah. And slushy I'm here for it. boozy drink. Yeah, it was so slushy. So slushy, and it was really delicious. Leah got very drunk. Oh my off gosh, of one, one, of one them. bushwhacker. I was like, my knees are bushwhacked. Wee. I was bushwhacked. Yeah. She was so bushwhacked. And then I had yeah. a beer as well as the bushwhacker. bushwhacker. And we went to one of the honky tonks that wasn't very busy. And it was pretty much, em we went upstairs. Downstairs was full. We went upstairs. There was more bands up there. And no one was up there really. And it yeah. was a little bit awkward, but we also kind of loved it. Is that where we did Sambuca shots or was that somewhere no, else? No, was somewhere, that else. Was somewhere else. Okay, so. The first place. The first place. Where we had nachos. Nachos and bushwhackers. Mm. Okay, so nachos, bushwhackers, and the band that were singing were actually really good. They were called yeah. like Mystic, Mis, Mis, mm, Mystic Mist Mushroom, Mystic Pizza, Mystic, 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 Mystic People. No, Mist Mist something. Anyway, Mystic. they had a they Mystic had a, Pickle. Mystic Pickle, but spelt funny, like Mystic with no vowels. Yeah, Mystic Pickle. And um, uh, yeah, and they were really good. The lead yeah. singer, especially, she was really, really good. Mm -hmm. And we were just like cheering them on. Like there was literally hardly anyone there. All yeah. the other bars were packed. So we were like, we'll just go somewhere quiet first and then we'll go somewhere more packed later. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, there was a hilarious woman, the oh drunk woman. Suddenly this she drunk was woman. an icon. And her husband or partner came up the stairs. He wasn't as drunk as she was. And she was just dancing at the front in this empty bar with just me and Leah sat there. And the husband was just sort of stood there. You could tell he was just not enjoying it yeah um and then she kept going up to people so there was probably about three pockets of people there including us so she went up to one couple and was like come dance come and they were like no no no. and then she started coming over to us and i was like leah leah she's coming over she's coming over yeah she's like do you want to dance and we were like oh no we were okay thanks like, it was a totally dead bar she was like why not like, come on and we were like no it's cool and we just were not at the her level she was no. so drunk it was amazing to witness, amazing. though. Like she and kept the, nearly like knocking over the tip jar of the people on stage. It we was the like, husband that like I found hysterical because yeah. he was so embarrassed and he was just like sat there like this. And then eventually, she wanted to go clearly because no one was dancing with her. So they're packing up, and as we left, the husband looked at us and was like, and like pointed at her as if oh, to be like, "Oh my god, she wants leave. to go." Yeah, it was um, hysterical. So funny. Um, but that was the first place. Yeah. So that was. Yeah, I can't remember what that was called. I think it was just called like Honky Tonk Barbecue or something. Something like, oh, yeah. Rip, Rip, please, Rip, Rippies. Rippies? Yeah, yeah might like have been that. And then from there, what did we do after that? We went to... Then we to... went walking down the strip and we went somewhere, maybe like the stable or something. And we went in and they patted me down for guns and they, um, did they checked our down? ideas, yeah. checked your bags. They were very strict. And we went in and then we it was so packed, we were like, let's just leave. So we left. Are they the ones that told me I couldn't take the cameras or yeah. any footage? So I opened my bag. I had my G7X and my GoPro. And they were like, you can't use anything like this in here. And I was like, it's just amateur. And they were like, you can do, amateur. you can be on your phone. Like you can take stuff on your phone. And I was literally thinking like, it's, Hun, no it's literally no different. Like my G7X is literally the same as this iPhone. So funny. Um, so we just walked in. It was super packed, as Joel said. And then... And it was just urinals. We wanted a toilet, but... Oh my God, yeah. We needed the loo. Joel walked, walked in, saw the urinals, walked straight back out. He was like, like, I, I can't, can't go in there. And I, I was can't. Like, 
So then we Jeez. made our way to another one. I can't remember what it was called, but it was a bit quieter. Yeah. And we sat at the bar and had a shot of Sambuca reach, but they were so expensive. It was a, we paid with tip about $22, $24 or something like that. Um, yeah. And the vibe was not lit. The bar, the people behind the bar were miserable. We were trying to banter with them, but they just weren't having any. Oh, well, sure. We were like trying to ask them if you looked like a, no, a local or a tourist. Yeah. Joel got his Nash hat, which you guys saw on the last live stream, I think. And my new Nashville jumper. Nashville jumper. Which he doesn't wear at the same time. No. Don't worry. Not and he was Nash. wearing the Nash. T- and when they we were like local or tourist, like just try and imagine that we haven't spoken. You just witness him. Yeah. Local or tourist. And they were like, local. Uh, so yeah, that was nice. Yeah. They redeemed themselves. But anyway, after doing some Zambu- Sambuca with an S, yeah. not Z- I always say Z- it's Sambuca. Sambuca. We left after this. They were massive shots, like really, really big. We were like, okay. And um, we left out of there and then stumbled across, found another bar that was a bit more like vibey, you know, just better. Yeah. And we sat in there and then as soon as we found a seat, people just started talking to us and then we just yeah. spent the rest of the kind of evening with them. It was good fun. They were very drunk. Yeah. But, um, they and they fun, drove right? four hours from Missouri Eight or Kansas hours from or Kansas. something. Eight hours. Um, oh, Kansas City yeah. in Missouri. Yeah. So not Kansas. Um but yeah, four hours, and they were there for one of their birthdays, and we were like, four hours? That's I so thought he's, it was eight hours, he said he drove. Eight there. hours? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Eight hours, long... it wasn't four. Oh my gosh, that's awful. And then they were like, yeah, we're staying for a few days, and then driving eight hours back, and I was like... <laughs> oh my gosh, and we, we had to... I hope they never find this. Um, Leah had to lie for me, because out of three of them, there was a couple, like a straight couple, and then their gay best friend, and like... Yeah, it just, no. Leo was like, oh, this is my best friend. Jo- he's he's seen someone, he's got a boyfriend. Because basically they were like, you two not married? And we were like, no. And then they were like, they just couldn't get their head around that. And then when she was like, oh, my best friend, he's gay. And I was like, oh, okay. And he, he started saying how much he fancied Joel. And then I was like, oh... Joel seeing someone. Sorry. What are the chances of that? What are the chances? And then um, her, his drunk female friend was like, she was so drunk, she hugged me. She was like, my best friend is so hot. And I was like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Wasn't your type, was he? Not my type. No. Um, he was lovely though, but I was just like, why? no. Um, so I'm glad you lied. So I, I just thought, thought of it on that. the spot. Like, sorry, he's seeing someone. Because then he was like, oh, so you've got a boyfriend. And I was like, yeah. And he was like, wow, you're so lucky. It's really hard to find a boyfriend in Kansas City. I was like, oh, okay. Oh, Little did I God. know inside, I was thinking, it's hard in London too. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and then, yeah, so we, tr- we try with them, whiskey. We had, yeah. um, ten- not Tennessee. The whiskey was actually from Kentucky, yeah. I think. Yeah, yeah. And it was, I didn't like it. Like, I'm glad we tried it, but it really burnt your throat. Yeah, it burnt the throat. And also combined with the, what did we try earlier? Bushwhackers. Sambuca, bushwhacker, Like, like. it was just all the combination for a hangover. Do you know what I mean? All that mixing. And then by the time we got home, um, yeah, I was just like, "Mm, this is not going to be a good sleep. But this is the thing. It's not even that much alcohol. Just to put in perspective, it was like, for me, it was two drinks and two shots. And for you, it was one drink and two shots. Yeah, but it's just the combo. It was the mixing. Yeah, yeah. And it was the adrenaline. No, I'm not saying that to invalidate your hangover. I'm saying it's to reinforce that we're not alcoholics. Oh, agreed. Yeah, we're not Um, actually alcoholics here. Um, Quick super chat break as we are... Oh. um, We're just, uh, just going through the super chats. So let me just go, go up a bit further. Uh, we got to that, yeah. Okay. Um, Amanda Jones has been a... Okay, that's Amanda Jones has been a member. Uh, moving on. Joe. Hi, Hi Joe. Joe Malik. Hello, me legends. Hello, me legends. Super duper late fee. Had to catch the last two live streams on replay. Aw, oh, that's oh gosh, sad. Tragic, Joe. Glad Honestly, you're here now. Love you guys so much. So glad you're able to travel again. Thank you, me legends. <laughs> Anyway, and Joel saw your tattoo video. You are naughty boy. Thank you, your parents. <laughs> you are a naughty, naughty boy. boy. Thank Honestly. you, I am. You keep thinking I'm a bad boy, don't you? Yeah, I keep like catching glimpses of his tattoo and going, oh, I forgot you're like a bad boy now. Yeah. Like, I don't know who you are. I'm such a bad like, boy. Like, is it this one? It's this one, yeah. Yeah, like sometimes you go like that and I'm like, yeah. bad boy. Where's like, that bad boy come he's from? He's a bad boy now. Um, yeah, he's such a naughty yeah, boy now. So naughty. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, so thank you, Joe. I agree. Thanks, Joe. 
ASP Las Vegas said good job. Thanks, Las Vegas. Thank you. It's so good to be here again. We're loving being here. Um, okay, just quickly moving on. Yeah. Karen. Hi, Hi Karen. Hi, Kaza. Karen said, Joel, I cannot believe you passed up on seeing Lauren <laughs> Daigle for chicken. I know. So excited to hear more from Nash. Oh, more from Nashville excursions. Meet any more legends? I think we did actually. Um, Last night, the guy with the lovely. Oh, yeah. yeah. What was his name? Josh? We got him on camera, yeah. so you'll see him in a vlog. We were just Josh, walking yeah. and he was carrying a keyboard. And I looked over and he was like, like sort of waved. And, and I just was like, oh, I don't know if he's just a drunk person or not. So I looked away and then I was like, oh, no, but remember, some people know who you are here. So I like turned around again and he was like, wave so I was like oh and then I was like hey I watch you guys on YouTube and I was like oh you're not drunk you're just a musician <laughs> <laughs> yeah and so we shot we stopped and chatted um to I'm like 99% I think sure it his was, name Josh. was Josh and chatted to him for a bit and he was gigging locally so we had yeah. a chat with him um have we met any other legends I'm not no. sure if we have actually no I don't think so didn't someone wave at you in a bar no, no, I walked in somewhere. We walked in and there was a table right by the door and the woman looked and went, <gasps> and then we just kept walking. And in my head, I was like, was that a gasp because she... Is a legend. Is a legend and she was starstruck or was she just gasping at something or did we look like a ghost because we're so pale? Could have been that. Could, Could have been, been any that. of the above. But anyway. Um, so, yeah. But yeah, Lauren Daigle, by the way, I've seen her before in person. So, it, you know, have you? and I've never had hot chicken before. So, where did you see Lauren Daigle in London? In London. Where she with my mom. Yeah, at the O2 Academy. Oh, lovely. Um, it was crazy. It was good fun. Yeah. And yeah. I even had a meet and not meet, meet and, and greet, but it was like, there was like 30 of us that went in before everyone else and did like a QA with her. Lovely. lovely. Love that. Right. Okay. So, um, scrolling up. Sorry, scrolling. guys. I have to make sure I don't miss anybody on my scrolling technique as IT department. Mm -hmm. um, okay. G uh, firstly, new, new member. Oh, and it's a new legend. That's not the oh, phrase. Oh, it's Let's a new again. legend. It is new legend, actually. Yeah, but it's our new phrase as member. Yes. New, new member. member. Welcome, Lynn. Lynn, welcome to Legend. You can now watch all of the Helena videos. Oh well, the gosh. two Helena two. videos that are up. We're going to film another one. Yes, we're due to make another one. Yeah. Uh, GD Haney. Hi, GD Haney. Said, stupid YouTube did not give me a reminder, despite my distinct smashing of the reminder button. <laughs> Smash that like button. My subscription and my bell ringy dingy. Ringy dingy. So triggered, love you. Oh my gosh, sometimes it does that, you know. So annoying. It's like, why can't YouTube just do its job? Why can't it just do the notifications? Like, we set it's this up so in the morning. Annoying. It should have notified everybody. Guys, if you could um, all give the video a like as well. There's over 800 people here, which is crazy. Thank um, you for joining us. only one thumbs up at the moment. We Just can only crazy. see one. It says one dot dot dot. So yeah. that's one. Um, so did you check any rooftop bars out? We yes, actually did today. tonight. So we'll get on to that. Yeah, today, tonight. Tonight, yeah. today. From day to night. Yeah. Nashville, day yeah, by yeah, day yeah, by yeah. night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we'll go into what we did today, but just quickly, Michael. Thank you very much, Thank Michael. Thank you, Michael. Glad you had fun. Did you have jalapenos, jalapenos. on those nachos? Oh, we yeah, did. we did. I had like one jalapeno. Yeah. Joel had a few. Yeah, I, I think I had two, and we picked the rest off. I just can't hack them. I can't t taste them. I, I can hack like them the on the night. It's the next morning that I it's can't. It's bringing hack them, them home for you, isn't it? It's bringing them home. Yeah. So I uh, I limited myself to two. I did want more. This is the hard thing. Imagine, guys, that there's a food that you really like. Yeah. But when you eat it, the next morning you pay for it. So I had to be very disciplined. Yeah. Anyway. So you were very very disciplined. I mean, that's probably everyone with IBS. But anyway. Okay. Um. But yeah, today was so much fun. We got up early, went to the gym and stuff, and then we went for brunch. And we were supposed to go to Love Biscuits, as recommended by so many of you. Love and we walked Biscuits. there. We walked to the Gulch, took some pics and stuff. But Love Biscuits had a massive queue outside of it. So yeah. we actually didn't end up going to Love Biscuits. It was like one hour wait or something to get into Love Biscuits. So we looked across the road and we saw this British pub and we were like, no way. It just reminded us of when we were in 
uh, where did we go? Toronto. Toronto. And we, we, we went, ran into the Elephant and Castle and everyone was like, you need to go there yeah. and rate it. So we were like, let's just do Brits in a British pub in Nashville. Well, before um, that, we were like, shall we do that? And then we're like, let's just keep walking. So we found a Barry's boot camp oh, yeah. and got a protein shake. And then we asked them for recommendations, but they were like, oh, to be honest, lots of brunch places are closed around here midweek. And we were like, yeah, That's we were weird. like really confused. So loads of stuff in Nashville doesn't open midweek. Yeah. And they were like, yeah, it's just bigger on the weekends. Nashville's mm. just better on the weekends. So yeah. I think that's why we got a bargain at this Airbnb. Yeah. No I one think wanted so. it. Yeah. Which has still been fun and you wouldn't really know like all the restaurants and bars are open. Yeah. But just brunch vibes is yeah. not really a thing. Exactly. That's been um, so we did she was like, Why don't you go to Milk and Honey? We walked over to Milk and Honey in flat. the Gulch, closed. It was like, open, da, 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 closed Wednesdays. And we were like, it's Great. Wednesday today. Thanks a lot. So yeah, that's why we ended up at the British pub. Filmed a video there. Absolutely hysterical. Like, I think we ripped it to shreds. I feel really bad for them. But like, it was just so funny. Like, don't um, call yourself a British pub if you're not going to be a British, British pub. pub. It was British. The like, decor was great. It, it looked Nashville. like a real pub. But they made the food Nashville. Yeah. They were like, here's a bit of a British thing, but make it Nashville. Like, stick gravy on a breakfast. Like, it was so weird. Very weird. Anyway, so that was that. And then, um, what did we do after that? After that, we went to get the trolley. So the, <laughs> the Nashville trolley. trolley. And we've been looking forward to this. And as soon as we sat on the trolley, we were just like, oh. this is worth every penny. I nearly, f- oh, I practically fell asleep like in two seconds. Like it was the, it was like the trolley was like lulling along. It was like so rocking good. the baby to sleep. Yeah. And obviously I was really tired. I had really bad night's sleep. So I felt myself like closing my eyes and, and eventually I was like, Leah, wake up, like you've got videos yeah. to film. Poor old Leah had an early start as well. She had a call this morning. Yeah, um, so English time. So not only were you feeling a bit worse for wear from the night before, but you had to wake up extra early. So yeah, no wonder you fell asleep on the on the bus. Yeah. But that was so fun. And we got off about halfway round. Yeah. We walked down Music Row. We then found a Panera Bread. Oh, of yeah. Course. We were on that bus for a while and we were like, where should we get off? Where should we get off? Got off at Blumen Panera Bread near Taylor Swift's house, didn't yeah. we? Yeah. And then we went to find Taylor Swift's house. That was good. That was good. Waited for the trolley, continued the rest of the tour. Yeah. And then got off and went and got hot chicken. Classic. But then that was more props, wasn't it? Because then we went for a proper dinner afterwards. Yeah, we didn't get much from the chick. We just got like one sh- the kids strip. The kids' Like from basically from the kids menu like the strip of chicken tender each with the flavor we were after joel went medium medium i went mild yeah so sorry guys if we went to try hot chicken and didn't try any hot chicken i should have gone hot joel was like i could have taken more and i was like i should have gone less yeah and then yeah we got like a little side with it not enough to, for, to fill you for dinner so we had that like 4 p.m and then we waited and had like an actual dinner at seven which yeah. was nice and then had a bougie dinner, had some like cocktails, yeah. which is just probably not the best idea. Then I had another cocktail and then we, we joined out a beer and it. yeah, we came home. Yeah. It's been a lovely day and we got three videos filmed. Yeah. Being very productive. Our editors have just edited the Niagara Falls video, so that'll be out tomorrow. We just watched it and it's really, really good. So there's two Niagara Falls videos. Yeah. One of them's when it all went wrong. But one of them is when it all was going right. Yeah. So it's the one that all went right that's yeah. coming out first. And then hopefully on Sunday, it will be the one that all went wrong. Yeah, um, getting stranded. But yeah, that was that was the rundown. Mm. Um, right, Super Chat Break. Super Chat Break coming up. Joel is a bad boy for life. I love this. It's hysterical. You're such a bad boy. Such a bad boy. <sighs> I've just oh, done that thing again, again, honestly. Right, scroll I'm scrolling up. up. Look scroll for Amanda because it was Amanda's name. We have to stop on Amanda. Here we Hi, go. Hi, Amanda. Amanda. I'm so super glad y'all are having fun. We are. We are. I'm not a, I'm not a boring mom. I'm a cool mom. I'm a cool, cool mom. mom. I'm um, not a regular cool mom. Yeah. Uh, by the way, I've driven 24 hours to see someone, stayed three days and drove back. Road trips are so much fun. Really? 24 I hour drive. I hate road trips i hate them so much do you actually i like the longest one i've done recently like this was a year ago was to devon and it was like four hour drive and it's fun for like 30 minutes yeah and then you're bored and you're like can we just stop at a costa coffee or starbucks and get like a like do something fun like i just get so bored if i'm not driving i think they're so fun why? What do you do? It's good fun, isn't it? I really enjoyed the Greece road trip because Christy drove everywhere and just like all the views were lit. Well, yeah, and like, it was just so fun. Greece. And 
Yeah, I don't know. I don't know about Eng- English road trips. Can be fun. Me and actually doing one in January, like a little road trip around. But yeah, it would probably be like seven hours of driving. It's not that bad. In one go. So it would be like from the Midlands, we'll go to London, then London, we'll go down to like Chichester, then Chichester down to Cornwall. Oh, on different days. So like we'll stop doing overnight, and then like that's, that's not too bad. That's fine. That's fine. But driving road- like twenty four hours to see someone. We don't know if Amanda did stopping. Amanda might have done stopping. Amanda, you must have done stopping. You can't drive for 24 hours. Like, it's quite fun to stop somewhere and be like, oh, where are we going to stop? Okay. Do you know what I mean? I think you'd like it. I hate it. I just hate cars. I get car sick. Oh, you get car sick. And, like, I just don't, like, I get claustrophobic. I hate being in small spaces. Just thought, I need to get my laptop charger, so I'll be right back. Okay, right back. Um... Right, let me try and resume where we're left off. Where are we at? Where my bees at? Bob's creative days, late and flaky, need to get to bed as they have to be up at 5.15 tomorrow. Oh my gosh, early starts are the worst. Well, Bob, I hope you have a great sleep if you're seeing this. Um, Yeah, sleep well. All the light's gone out. We'll be back soon. Jackson Eric Brown, hello. Where are you all off to next? Uh, we are off to Orlando. Orlando, Orlando next. So yeah, yeah gonna We're be mental. Excited. We're gonna get a tan. Bad boy Joel and bad literally Joel. Leah. Why is it so annoying yeah, that like the um Florida series is at the end of our trip once we've gained about ten kilos of weight? I think we look exactly the same, maybe a tiny bit like. Joel was like watching a video of yeah. himself and he said he thinks his face is My bigger. face has gotten fatter and I can just grip it. Like, you know when you like grip your stomach and you're like, there's more fat there. But I'm trying to tell myself, it's fine, you're on holiday, Content enjoy holiday. it. And that when you're home, you can just lose the weight again. Yeah, but you'll be absolutely fine, I've darling. I've been eating absolute rubbish, but delicious rubbish since yeah. being here. I can't. I forgot to tell them I tried grits today. Oh yeah, we did. We'll save the opinion save that. for the vlog. Yeah, Bob's creative day. We've done that one, honey. Sorry, I was away getting the charger. One. Thank you, Jason. Thank you, Bob. Here we go. Alexander. Hi, Alexander. Me. Hi, Hi, Alexander. Thank um, you for your super chat. Thank you so much, and um, we are noticing you. You're having a whole moment right now. We notice all the super chats because they come up in big colours. So yeah, they, they stand them. out. We cannot miss them. Thank you, Alex. 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 Oh my goodness. Michael. Michael. Thank you, Michael. Cool. With me lord and me lady <laughs> in Miami, I hope that you will find a traditional Cuban restaurant for dinner. Oh, that Cuban sounds food good. is amazing. Here are a few shillings towards the meal. He's hilarious. Glad you're having a great tour. Thank, Thank you, you, Michael. Michael. That's so kind. Let's put Michael's name here. Right, come on. When I get to a dollar arm, I'm going to buy a whiteboard for us. Yeah, she did actually My... say that today. Oh. A-E-L. 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 Mala. Michael Mala. Thank you, Michael. We can't Thank wait you, to try Michael. Cuban food. Oh, I don't think I've had Cuban food. I've had other South... I've had Venezuelan food. Yeah. So I'm imagining it will be a similar vibe to that. Because I've heard, like, things like arepas, people mm. from Colombia and Venezuela, like, fight over who invented that. So yeah. I wonder if Cuban will be similar vibes yeah. as well. But I've I definitely... Don't I don't think I've had Cuban food, so no. that's definitely something new for me to try Bridge as well. try Cuban food for the first time. Yep. I smell a Cuban video coming on. I smell... <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. Okay, uh, people are laughing at jalapenos, jalapenos. Jalapenos. Janice. Uh, Janice. Hi, Hi Janice. Janice. How did you like Tennessee barbecue? It's my favourite. Oh, um, we did that we yesterday? We did. The day before yesterday. It was yesterday. It was yesterday. Wow. Um, yeah, we went to, was it Jack's barbecue? Mm-hmm. And we thought it was really nice, actually. We couldn't yeah. help We couldn't help but compare it to um, Texas barbecue. Mm-hmm. Uh, but you know what? It was really good. I think... We, I don't think we tried the best place, to be totally no. honest with you. But we'll save this for the video, because there will be a video coming out. So look out for it. Um, we might yeah. try, before we go, Edley's Barbecue, which yeah. everyone's been raving about. Raving about um, it. But yeah, the, yeah, it was fine. Yeah. Um, I don't want to spoil tasty. the video. It was tasty. It was tasty. It was tasty. Yeah. No, it was definitely, it was more than fine. It yeah. was just, maybe we prefer Texas. Maybe, maybe we didn't. Yeah. 
Um, can I just say, Eclectic Jellyfish said, one clap for Michael. One, two, three. Thank you, Michael. That's how they used to finish all my CrossFit classes. They were like, right, we're going to fish with a clap. Three, two, one. And then if we didn't all be in sync, have to do it again. Or someone would be like, two claps. One, two, three. And I'm just like, can we just not? Can you just end the class and just say, cool, see you next week or see you tomorrow? Oh, my gosh, it's till killing me. I know. It's like being at drama school again it when is. you've all got to be in sync. And especially when you're like amazing at clapping because we've been to drama school. So, like, I know how to clap in time, Dead. but then other people don't. It's hysterical. And it's like you're holding us up. I want to go home. <laughs> <laughs> it's like at school when the kids, someone asks a question and you're like, put your hand down. Anyone got any questions about the homework? And you're yeah. like, no one No asked one put your hand anything. Um, Katie Scoot, that trolley ride is phenomenal. Isn't it, it Katie? Is Scoot. It absolutely Scoot. is. It is I'll, Scoot. I always call her Honestly. Scoot. She knows it. She's I like, Scoot. I it's Scoot. Um, Rod Hi, Hi Rod. Rod A little late Don't you worry darling We're it's always okay. late To our own show Yeah literally Regular uh, Smashed reminder button <laughs> Smashed reminder button Instead of my notification Popping up on my screen As usual It went to my social media e In email instead YouTube just If everyone can honestly, just Write to YouTube And be like Stop Oh my gosh I'm yawning I'm doing a you Oh I've set you off if the, Yawns are contagious apparently They are That's what I've read and heard and seen and, and experienced. And no, and I've always said and I'm, it. And I've always said it. <laughs> Can you tell the story? Yes. Yeah, so my new favourite joke is to say something, perhaps something obvious or something that's been true for a long time, and you go, and I've always said that. Yeah. And so, so it could be something anything. like that. Yawns are contagious, and I've always, always said, said that. It. And it's funny because it's like, well, no, you haven't always said it. It's like... It's a thing that's been it's said. It's like a scientific research. <laughs> <laughs> it's just funny. It's just... My own sense You're like this. Be like, you know, water's so good for for the skin, and I've always said that. Yeah, I've it's always so said good. it, and I've always it's said like, it. Yeah, everyone tells you that, hun. Like, you've didn't coin that. It's yeah. amazing. I love it. Okay, um, Panera comes with free. Oh, I can't believe she read that one out loud. Oh yeah, I had a best cookie from Panera today. It's called a kitchen sink cookie, and it was sick. Yeah, it was nice actually. Yeah. Um. I'm just going to quickly scroll up because Classic Leo's computer has jumped and it's just like jumped <laughs> down the whole thing. Oh right, we've gosh. read Rod's comment. Right, here we are. Mark Barbera. Hi, Hi Mark. Mark. Glad to see you are enjoying your visit to TN. Did Leah try out Nashville hot chicken? If she did, very much deserves to receive a medal. She very much. I think that's meant to say very. Very much. Thank she you. did not, did she? No, I had the mild. Had the mild hot. Mild hot. I went to Bessie, Bessie Hattie's. Hattie Bees. I went to Hattie Bees. Bessie, where do I get this stuff from? Hattie Bees hot chicken. Yeah. And I had the mild chicken. So. Yeah, and that wasn't the lowest. The lowest was. Um, the Singapore? lowest was called. What was it called? Seasoned. Seasoned. I know it begins with S. Singapore. Did Se you actually call yeah. it Singapore? I was like, why is Singapore in my head? You've lost your marbles tonight. I really honestly, have. You've lost it. Anyway, um, so, so I So, yeah, was that gonna, was yeah. the lowest, and you went for the second one. Yeah. Um, but gonna... mine was medium, and it tasted of nothing, so I tried to think what the mild was. It was probably like... It was very flavoursome. Yeah. Yeah. My lips were on fire. <laughs> Actually, on fire. My, my, the skin of my lips peeled back. She's a delicate lady. Delicate flower. Yeah. Thank you, Marco Barbera. Um, Ryan, Ryan B. B. Are you two missing Peri Peri Chick? What was the chicken you tried in Nashville hotter? Well, no, because I um the medium at Nando's is definitely hotter than the medio medium at Hattie B's. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I think maybe if we've got time before we leave, I will branch out and try the hot. Okay. Because I um, think I could handle it. Are you two missing peri peri chicken? No, because no. I don't know if you remember, I was actually vegetarian re leading up to this trip. I was pescatarian for quite a long time, so this is the first time in quite a while having meat on the daily. Literally daily. So meat. this is should be called like vegetarian tries meat for the first time. We'll do that. Yeah, you can click that. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. RSP Las Vegas. RSP. I've been five dollars super, super chatting, chatting you for years. Late fee for your low fee membership. You guys rock. Ooh, low Thank fee you. membership. We love keeping our memberships low. We want everyone to be able to join yes. if they so wish. Because who can't afford a dollar? Everyone can afford a dollar. Yeah. So. 
Yeah. Yeah. Everyone can afford if they want to. They yeah. can. They can do it. Oh, it's all totally you optional, to, you guys. Yeah. But if you want to, the options there, rather than setting the bar high, um, making it unattainable. Yeah. Yeah. We don't want to be too exclusive. Exactly. Exactly. Um, oh, some people love road trips. Some people hate road trips. Yeah. Some people just don't like driving. We're all different, aren't, aren't we? Aren't we? <laughs> Rod, Rod Westwood. Westwood. Late fee. fee was watching Joel's parents react to his tattoo. Oh, it's a fabulous video. <laughs> <laughs> if I do say it's same and sound. Fabulous, fabulous, darling. Thank you, Rod, for Thank joining. Thank you, Rod. Glenn Mawson. Glenn Mawson. Hi, Glenn. Do you want tickets to Universal Studio Florida? I mean... Can you be careful sorry, with that yeah, dropping I'll pop near that. the microphone? Sorry, it's guys. Really on I just need something to fiddle with. I'm feeling very fidgety today. Do you want to fiddle with no, that? that's my chewing gum. Want... And that's your tissue. Um, okay, just... So I'll fiddle with my fingers. Um, I don't think we'll have time, to be honest. We would love to go to Universal, but already... So Nashville feels very rushed, and Orlando is going to feel very rushed as well. Talking. So Toronto and Miami is like the longest, the longer trips. Yeah. So yeah, already we've got two days which will be filled with Disney both days. And that leaves us three other days. And there's other things I've got planned for us on those days. So yeah, logistics for Florida sitting right here. So if, if it, you can't pass through logistics, I'm afraid you're not going to be able to pass through me either. So um, behalf of both of us, I don't, we'd love to, but unfortunately yeah. logistics does say no quite a lot. I actually enjoy uh, Universal more than Disney, controversially. So yeah, I'd love to go, but I don't think we have time. And the people have spoken, they want Disney. Have they actually spoken? Yeah. They have, yeah. Well, not to us directly, but they've written. Oh, they've written. The people yeah. have written. Um. Elizabeth loves your tattoo. Thank you, Elizabeth. Okay, so um, Alex, Hi, Alex. Alex said you two are adorable. I just got back from a 15-hour drive from Colorado to Washington in one day. Alex, that's a whole day gone. Yeah, you she, know just, what I mean? she just did it. Like Alex just does it. Alex, what do you do? Do you like talk to Siri? Do you listen to a podcast? Do you phone call your family? 100%. What phone do you do? Calls. Phone calls, turn your car into your university, listen to your podcasts, listen to all your self improvement, whatever, whatever you fancy, or just music, the whole way, music. Or silence. Sometimes when I drive from silence. Southampton to London, I have an hour and a half of just nothing and it's I just lovely. think, and it's so nice. Yeah, and you think about the road you're driving on. Or no, you just I, zone just, out. I just think, I daydream about things, and I pay attention to the roads, of course. Yeah. But yeah, I just daydream. Excellent work. Yeah, thank you. So you do like it, don't you? Well, an hour and a half is like tops. Nothing compared to Alex's 15 hour drive Absolutely from Colorado not. to Washington. No. Okay. Um, Kelly Hughes. Hi, Kelly. Hi, Kelly. Baby. Hi, Kelly baby. <laughs> um, I'm so glad you're in Nashville. Would love to take you out for a drink. Oh, thanks, Thank you, Kelly. Kelly. I mean, do you know what? If we bump into legends, we always just say, if we bump into someone, yeah, like, let's just make it happen. Yeah. But, um, we are just, oh, how long have we got left? So we've got, after tonight, we've got one night left here, and then we're moving to the, the airport for the night. Oh my God, no, because they don't have this flat on the Friday night I taken, know, so we've so moved annoying. to like an airport hotel, so we were thinking to like, check out, move our bags to the storage, pay like whatever, the $25, keep it in storage, and then just be in the area yeah. that day, or we just go to the airport hotel and just be in the airport area. It's going to be so dead. So dead. So dead. We may as well get a full day of like more video filming around here. Yeah, if there's anything left in. to film. Like... So we've done eight videos in Nashville so far, which our goal is 10. So pretty sure tomorrow we'll probably we'll do at least another two. So we'll hit the 10. So that's good. Yeah. Um, but yeah, if we can get even more. Then great. Fantastic. Yeah. It's always yeah. good to have content in the bag. Yeah. Okay, I think that brings us nearly up to date. Rainbow out. Hi, Rainbow, Rainbow out. Late fee. YouTube didn't tell. Uh, oh my gosh, another person that YouTube just didn't tell about. It's really triggering. YouTube need to be told off. Um, yeah, do, yeah. JNL, did you get the long, sorry, brackets, email I sent you with links and planning tips for Disney? I used to work for them in reservations and I thought I'd give some tips. We did, I think we did actually. We did get a long email about Disney. Um, let me just I don't remember definitely seeing it. see if 
we do, oh I've turned my thing off so that this doesn't the Wi-Fi doesn't okay. steal it we'll check but um, I do remember seeing a long email about Disney but now that you say links I'm thinking was it your email maybe it went into junk we'll have to check but one thing Joel did say today was we need to listen to the legends and book those tickets yeah we need to do we've that we've got the access night. but we haven't secured the spot yeah we and everyone's to telling us to secure the spot yeah we'll secure the bag and what else did you say about huh? we have to rec- you were like there's another bit of admin that's important for us to booking do booking the car we yes we've been car. sent um, I think it was Gary one of the legends sent us a discount code so thank you for that and yeah. we need to book the car and the parks yeah so thank you for reminding thank you everyone us. for sending like discounts recommendations tips um, yeah. really really appreciate it thank you Rainbow Owl Thank you. Kelly Morgan. Hi, Kelly. I forget. What's Leah's Hogwarts house? Have a round of butter burrs on me. Um, Hufflepuff, babes. Hufflepuff. Hufflepuff through and yeah. through. Yeah, Hufflepuff through and through. I've even bought my Hufflepuff socks with me. I've worn them a couple of times. You're Just such your a house. cutie. Yeah, I do such it for her. Such a cutie. <laughs> <laughs> no, I do it for her. I do it for her. Really. I just do it for her. Really. Leah, I'm wearing your socks. <laughs> They're yellow, right? Yeah. Yeah, love that. Yeah. Love that. Um, people are saying you need to try hot chicken. So just to confirm, for anyone who's just turned up, today Joel and I filmed the Brits try, can where is it? Not Kansas, Tennessee hot chicken. Yeah. From Nashville, and we didn't get the hot flavor because I can't do spice, and Joel went mediums chicken mm. out. So we might have to go back there. Fine, we'll go back again and we'll try the hot. We'll but try the hot, if Leah but... tries the hot, she will never recover. No, I'm not having the hot. You will have the hot and I'll have the flavourless. Okay. Today I had the mild and he had the medium. Yeah. So, yeah. Is it we up to Rod? <laughs> yes. Hi, Hi Rod. Rod Westwood. Try a traditional Cuban sandwich with tostonase and maduros. Joel might like Cuban coffee, but Leah likely will not. Mojitos all around. Oh, we love Ooh. mojitos. Oh, yeah, Cuban coffee. I imagine that would be very, very strong. I love Colombian coffee, so I imagine Cuban coffee probably would be even stronger than Colombian coffee. Really? I'd be buzzing. Is, but it, quite, is it quite thick? I, not really, no. It quite, it's all still... Is it like Americano in, in the... Um, it's just the roast. So you can get medium roast, light roast, or dark roast. Yeah. So I think normally, if it's strong, it would just be a very dark roast. Okay. But Understood. it wouldn't change the thickness of okay. the water. Understood. Not that I'm aware of. Okay. But I'm not a coffee snob. I literally drink instant. He's not a coffee connoisseur. No. No. I mean, it's actually fine. It's got a nice quality about you. It's got uh, thing about you that you're not a oh, coffee snob. I'm very grounded. Very, very grounded. grounded. That's got to stay. Oh, I'm... Oh, very I'm very down, down to earth. earth. I actually am. I don't know why I'm joking about that, but still. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, thank you, by the way, Rod, for the suggestions. Moving swiftly on. New, New member. member. Hi, Crystal. Hi, Crystal. Oh. Hope you enjoy Legend. Welcome. I'm so glad. It makes me so happy when I see people becoming members. Four new members on this stream so far. One oh, clap for four the claps. Okay, one, two, three. Oh, you tried to speed that up, didn't you, you little spicy I ting? I actually was not spicy ting in. I was looking in the camera finder to try and sync up with you. Okay. And I was like, what pace are we going at? Well, that's the fun of it. That is the fun. Yeah. felt just like you did at the end of your gym class. Yeah, literally. That's what I felt like. <laughs> that's what everyone in my gym class is like. Albert! Hi, Hello. Albert. How are you? I've said it before and I'll say it again. You are the m- that you are the most absolutely fabulous Brit since Patsy and Edina, Edna, Ed- Patsy, isn't it? Yeah, Patsy Edina. And Edina. Yeah. Why did I not recognise the second name? I was like, it's Pat. Or Patsy and Eddie. Yeah, for sure. Patsy and Eddie. Yeah. Um. Thank you, Albert. Thank you. Thank How you. iconic. Iconic Brits. Iconic. We love oh being fabulous Brits, don't we? Yeah, we absolutely love being absolutely fabulous Brits. Mm-hmm. Um. And do you know what? This reminded me randomly of the, all these branded uh, slogan T-shirts we've been seeing so around many. Nashville. So we've noticed that people around here love wearing a slogan T-shirt. Mm-hmm. So some of the funny ones we've seen are like, um, what's the one about morals that was quite funny? Keep your morals. Oh, I, I want a T-shirt that says tight jeans, loose morals. Really funny. So cool. We just keep seeing one like, just funny stuff like, Another, Wasn't day, there one that was another like, day of bad decisions. or like, I'm just, getting hitched, so buy me a shot or something. Buy me, I'm... 
getting drink. I'm getting it rhymed drinks. with yeah, shot. shots. Buy me a round. Oh, I'm tying the knot, so buy me a shot. shot. Honestly, there's so, so many funny. funny ones, and like they go on and on and on, and everyone seems to be wearing slogan tees. So we're yeah. gonna go. I think we're gonna go into a slogan tee shop and have a laugh tomorrow. Yeah, be entertaining. Maybe buy a pajama top or something. Lovely. Um, just can possibly wear one out unless it was just one of our slogans. Like fine, not yeah. Not, you know, I've actually bought my triggered hat with me on holiday. Yeah, I was so close to bringing my pink one, and I'm really regretting not. Like I put it in my pile and then I took it out. Mm. So annoying. Okay. They're limited edition, you know. They are. Um, yeah. Okay, maybe right they switched the order. This is so interesting. Oh, maybe they switched the order and Joel ate the mild and Leo ate the medium. That would not surprise me. Mine was really tingling my lips. Maybe they did because I felt nothing and I, I was felt like, everything. it's not spicy. That's, probably That's what's what happened. happened. That is what's happened. You're so clever, George. You're or so, Jorge. Jorge, so you're clever. so clever. That's, I think that's what's happened. Great. So I've had a mild chicken. What a Great. Waste. So you've come all the way to Tennessee to have a mild chicken. Well done. Anyway. Brit Bra. Hi, Hi Brit, Brit Bra. Bra. Hey. hey. What surprised you all the most about Nashville? Leah loving the lip shade. Thank you so much. What Brit shade Bra. is it? They always have hilarious names. They always no. Shall I just go? It, they all. Who writes the names? It's usually like Walk of Shame by Charlotte Tilbury. So it's funny. It's hysterical. Who it's writes so the funny. name? Some some of them are really rude. Like they get really sexual. Oh, no. I know. I won't read it out. I won't okay. read it out. But maybe on another stream. Oh, why? Um, Brit Brat. What, what surprised us the most, the most about Nashville? Nashville? I think the noise, <laughs> and not in like a bad way. It's incredible being on Broadway. And just the noise of all of these musicians and all the noise coming out onto the street and basically the bars, they have massive floor to ceiling windows that they just pull open so that all of, initially I was like, oh, it's to keep everyone cool inside, but it's not. It's so that the music floods out onto the strip and then it lures people in. I love it when you're walking past, they're playing with the doors open mm. and like one of the guitarists starts playing to the street, yeah. but the rest of the band are playing to the inside venue people and you're like, Love this 360. That like, is so cool. It's so um, good. What surprising. Um, to be honest, the I don't. Slogan tees. The slogan tees are funny. I don't know if I'm surprised. I'm fine. And I'm entertained. I think. Um, I knew it was a music capital, but I didn't quite realise it was because I hadn't seen pictures of Nashville and I, yeah. I hadn't googled like the main strip or the main street and stuff like that. I didn't really know what to expect. I did expect like recording studios and music row vibes, but I didn't quite know it was going to be like, you look around, you're literally like, this is entertainment. Like you, you spoil for choice. It's like yeah. honky tonk, honky tonk, honky tonk. Yeah. Like it's blown my mind. Like the first time I saw it, I was like, as if this is where we are. Like this is just, so cool. imagine this is like your local street. Like it's just mad. We keep on having moments where we just turn to each other and go, we're in Nashville. Phil? We, and then it's we just crazy. pause for like five seconds and say nothing. It's mad. But do you know what? I really would like to come back and do Tennessee as a whole. Like go to the Smoky Mountains or go somewhere a bit more rural to see the real Tennessee. Yeah, like Stay Dollywood. on a ranch or like, yeah. And then see yeah. Memphis. And yeah. like, I'd love to explore more because I think, I feel like we have been to Tennessee. Obviously, Nashville is a part of Tennessee, but I feel like we can't really truly scratch say. Scratch the surface. Yeah, we've just scratched the surface of it's Tennessee. Literally just like itched a little bit of a... Yeah. Just itch that little, like, one or two streets. And I just think Tennessee is my new favourite state. Honestly, so, fall in love with everyone. I've bought all the merch. I've got Nash hat, Nashville jumper. Yeah, that's Nashville nice, that mug. one. I've got three bits of Nashville merch. That's nice, that one Thank as well. You. And it's a collab with Champion. Champion. It was bloody expensive. But I said to Leah... How much is this? So it came to about $75. So um, what are we looking at in English? We're looking at about 50, 55 quid or something, 50 quid. Yeah, see, Joel usually only buys sale items. Yeah, literally. So this is quite a big deal for This Joel. is a big deal for me. But I said to Leo when I arrived, I was like, I want a Tennessee jumper. I want a nice loungewear jumper that says Tennessee. And I haven't seen any. And yeah. then I saw this and I was like, you know what, Joel? Just get a Nashville one. Because you yeah. haven't seen lots of Tennessee. You've just seen Nashville. So get So Nashville. you just didn't want imposter syndrome. Yeah, I want okay. this to be accurate. Okay. Yeah. Um... Thank you, Kimberly, for Leah's tea. Oh, thank, thank you so you. much, honestly. You've had a good one today. Where was that? British Panera pub Bread. And then Panera Bread. British pub was dead. It was. It was you like, told me, you, you said it's not bad. I literally remember filming the clip and bad. you were like, it's not bad, actually. That's quite good. Because they had twinings. Do you know what, Joel? In retrospect, 
it was a bit dead. Oh, I think just, being polite. You're being polite. It wasn't. It wasn't the. It was. I've had worse tea in Canada actually. It wasn't the worst tea. It wasn't the best. It was just. It was just. Do you know what? Okay. I, just, I won't remind you. Do you know what's it. fine? It's like, her, what happened in that video is like I, I, I'd slagged off everything about the place, and I was like, now the tea's arrived. Like, what am I going to do? Just be a miserable bint the whole video. Yeah. So I just said, mm, it's not bad. But in what does not bad mean? Well, to Americans that means oh great, but to Brits we know not bad means like it's a bit bit drab. Mm. Anyway, thank you, Kimberly. Sorry, didn't mean to go off on one about tea there. Elena, Elena, Elena doll. doll, Elena, Elena. We always get her name wrong every time, and every time we say it, we go. She reminds us of it, yeah. and then I think it's Elena, Elena doll, and we say Elena. Yeah, I'm it's so Elena sorry. doll. It is Elena. Elena, I knew it. Elena. Get, get this. this. On my birthday, my mum and brother are going out to dinner and a movie that my brother picked without me because of my immune system. Aww. Another typical birthday. Sad 11.25 Thanksgiving too. Aww, oh, sad, I'm sorry Lena. to hear that. Oh, no. Because of my immune... They picked a but they picked this movie without you because of your immune system. So are they going to see the movie and go out for dinner to celebrate your birthday, but, but without you? But you're not you? going. They're like going, oh, this one's on a... Le- like, cheers. Oh, that's Happy sad. birthday, Alina. You can video call in from home. Like, that's pretty no. tragic, isn't it? If that was us, Alina, we'd just go, right, we're coming to you. Yeah, we'll do something local. Yeah, we'll have a sleepover. Sleepover. Immune system welcome. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, sorry to hear that. Yeah. Sarah Wolf. Wolf. Obviously, Jennifer Biggs can't afford a dollar. Oh, is someone being hateful in the comments about memberships? Oh, okay, okay. I think it's the same Jennifer that was in our hate comments live, where they were like, I I would like to be a member, but I refuse to pay a dollar. You shouldn't make things exclusive or something like that. And yeah, it just made no or sense. someone was like, it might not have been Jennifer, but she. someone was like, practically a members only channel now yeah and you're literally like i i nah i can't now nah, i'm not standing for that one we've literally like, filmed 20 videos in toronto for everyone and now eight in nashville for everyone and we haven't even finished we still got over two weeks not left to here. mention the hundreds of videos in catalog of, yeah. like in backlog of our channel that are just anyone can watch the amount them. of charity work we <laughs> have done the free content we've churned out and the audacity to say that we're a members only channel now. We're really not. It's just not we're true. not a members only channel. We've got no. optional membership. No one's obliged of No. If you feel like we're enforcing you, like you've made that up in your head. Yeah, we've literally said if you don't want to become a member, don't. But we've made it so that everyone could if yeah. they wanted to. If you could then you would. If you could then you would. Um this is quite good. Are yeah. we going to have a Legends Thanksgiving live stream? Oh, yeah. Knowing you're going to be here in the US on Thanksgiving. Absolutely. Maybe, well, a, maybe a morning or maybe a... Yeah, when would it be good for you guys? Because I imagine you'll all be busy and no one will tune in I to think Thanksgiving that'd live stream. I think that would be a fun stream. one. That would be fun. It would be good. I mean, we'll do it regardless. Like, we're yeah. doing a live stream every day, so it's going to happen. But Special in my one. head, I'm like, on Thanksgiving, we're going to have, like, no one tuning in because everyone will be with their families. But, but they maybe might just want it on in the background. Yeah. Or sometimes you're just with your family, but you're on your phone. Or you could just force all your family to watch. Yeah, that would be fun. It would be a lot of pressure for us, but we'll bring we'll bring, we'll bring the it. action. Do, 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 do. We'll, we'll all from. go round and just all say what we're thankful for. Yeah. It's really fun. Yeah. That's really that's nice. That's really fun. Okay. New, New member. member. Julie Daly. Thank you, Julie Daly. Welcome to memberships, Welcome. Julie Daly. You're now a legend. Okay. So, um, Meredith. Hi, Hi Meredith. Meredith. Here's a little something, something to put towards getting Ava either a Harry Potter or Disney engraved tag for her collar. That's cute. Oh, that's so cute. Thank you, Meredith. I'll definitely, I need to get Ava a gift before I go home. She'll be absolutely livid. That well, she'll be Devo. She'll be Devo. She loves travel. She um, loves travel. And she loves America just as much as I do. So she's Devo that she can't be here. Yeah. Um, so yeah. I'll do that. Thank you. How hard would it be for you to bring Ava to America one time? Obviously, I'd have to get her a passport, which would be fine. I'd just like, dog pay, have to yeah. pay quite a bit for it. But um, I just wouldn't put her through it. Like, on the flight, I'd have to put her in the hold. And I don't want to do that. It's kind of sad, yeah. isn't it? I oh. could get her registered as an emotional support dog, which I know people that have done that, even though they're not emotional support dogs. 
fraud. Ther- um, therapy dog. But I'm therapy dog. But I just think Ava would be a nightmare on a flight as well. I, if I had her on my lap, whatever. What if she wants a poo or a wee on the eight-hour flight? Like, like what, that do, would you be do? Awful. what yeah. do you do? Did you like, hold her over the thing? Like, what do you do? 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 So in that sense, I'd want to put her in the hold, but then obviously I don't want to. So yeah, probably will never travel with Ava. Um, Maybe just car journeys. Yeah, just car journeys. Can she chill out in the car? Just yeah. long time. Yeah, oh, she, yeah, she sleeps out. in the car. Yeah, yeah, that's nice. Yeah. Um, but we won't drive to America, I imagine. <laughs> imagine. <laughs> okay, so thank you, Meredith. Yes, thank um, you. Danny. Hi, Hi Danny. Danny. Late fee, but was busy. But was busy. But now it's Joel and Leah time. Woo! Gucci. Gucci. We don't know why, but we keep doing that. Um, been meaning to become a member, really just so I don't have to do as many super chats. Haha, <laughs> joking. <laughs> no one has to do super chats. Uh, Please never feel obliged, you. guys. Thank you, Danny. Thank you. Any super chats are a bonus as far as we're concerned. Yes. Um, but yeah, consider becoming a member. Do yeah, it. why not? Do, yeah, it. do it. Enjoy the Helena content. Yeah, you can unsubscribe at any time, by the way. If you just want to pay $1 for one month, then you go, actually... Not bothered. Watch load of videos. That's, fine. That's me done. Yeah. Yeah. Casey. Casey hello. stock still. We love you, Casey. Hey Joel and Leah. I had Hi. a six hour training for work today. So happy to be here with y'all. Relaxing tonight. Oh, I love the image of other people on the other side of the camera just kicking back and relaxing with us. It's lovely, isn't it? It's lovely. Just cheers. I know we've got water, but cheers. Because we're cheers. really, you know, we're recovering from honky tonk. So. Yeah, honky tonk. I think we will have more Prosecco on the live streams when we're in Florida, but because Nashville is very much about the nightlife, like we've already had our cocktails out there oh and we can't goodness. drink anymore. There's not been a day in Nashville that we haven't had alcohol. Mm. But just before, let's pick up where Casey Sorry, left yeah. off because this was a really big donation. Thank you, Casey. Cheers to Casey. I've got no drinking. Okay, bad luck. Okay. Um, driving 14 hours to Florida at the beginning of December for my cousin's wedding. Wow. Wow, that's a long drive. Um, hope you continue to have an amazing time. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. Oh my gosh, 14 hour drive. You guys are crazy. You must love road trips. And what's the dis- weather like in December in Florida then for a wedding? Not bad. Like it's not like um, Floridians would say it's bad, but yeah. it'll probably be like for us lowest, probably like 15 degrees. So that's quite nice then, because someone who's getting married, you won't be hot. No. You won't be like, oh, you won't be sweating. it's too hot for a wedding. But it is more muggy down there, because it's tropical climate. We're it's going muggy. to a tropical climate. Are you ready for that? Am I it's... going to get, like, what do I need to buy? Like, chafe cream? Like, what do I need? Is it going to be too intense? No, I think you're just, you, you just feel sticky. It's not like Vegas dry heat. It's tropical, so it's like muggy. The air feels a bit thicker. And you just feel a bit sweaty and wet all the time. So you kind of, you just rinse, you just, you shower yeah. more. You're just yeah. like, oh, morning, mm. shower, night Although it won't be shower. as bad because it's obviously not as hot at the moment, but yeah. I actually find Nashville quite chilly in the evening. Mm. Even like, as soon as the sun's gone down, I'm like, oh, it was really I need warm another today, layer. Though, wasn't it? it was warm, but I'm always cold. Yeah. So we were like on this bus and it was gorgeous. And when the sun was shining on us, I was like, lovely. But the wind, I was like, oh, give me my jacket. She's a little lizard. Yeah. Yeah. So just... Should I refill our drink? Yes, yeah, of course. Are you about to sneeze? No, it's. I smelt something of yours. A burp. I smelt it intensely. I do not burp. I smelt something in the air. Maybe, Maybe it the fibres, the fumes. It probably was a burp, but I did through my nose. How? Wow, that's amazing. Um, talented legend. No, don't devalue the legend. I won't devalue. I'm taking that one back. Okay, um, people are talking about the Parthenon. Yes, 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 we saw it on the bus. It was mind blowing. I can't believe they literally built a replica of the Parthenon. I was like, shut up, that's mad. Um, we also found out loads of really good stories on the bus today. Like um, when we were, when they were talking about the hot chicken, they told us the story of how uh, Tennessee hot chicken, is it Tennessee or Nashville hot chicken? Nashville. Tennessee. Tennessee hot chicken of how it came about with the guy cheating on his wife and then the wife wanted her revenge and yeah. she basically got all the spice in her cupboard mm-hmm. he came home and was like I mm-hmm. want food I want food and she was like oh um yeah uh, she was like yeah yeah honey like not acknowledging the fact that he'd not come home that night and he slept with his mistress and then mm-hmm. the next day she made him 
the spiciest chicken imaginable. All the spices. And she thought like that would be her revenge. And then he tasted it and he was like, I love that. And then he stole the recipe, sold it and made yeah. made dollar. Left her and then made all the money on mm-hmm. her Thank joke you. recipe. Thank you. You are so welcome. Don't be there. Um, MK, did you all go to the Gulch for pics with angel wings? Yeah, we did. Yeah, it was so basic. We loved it. We love being basic bitches and we even walked around with our protein shakes, took a po- pic with the angel wings. It was great. And you got a nice one on the love hearts wall. Oh, you got love heart wall, got angel wings, walked around the gulch, which is gorgeous. But why did they call it gulch? It's the most disgusting name I've ever heard in my it's life. It's such a horrible word. It sounds like a, a mix between the words gulp and belch. Imagine... Like gulch. <laughs> That's funny. Imagine paying two to three mil for an apartment in the Gulch and then having to tell people you live in the Gulch. The Gulch. That's probably why like, Taylor didn't buy an apartment in the Gulch. Yeah. Even though it's like the most expensive place. Also, I don't think she's about that. She's not about she's that. She's about music, bro. I mean, she's you about, say that, she's got about seven houses, so it's like, she's yeah, a little bit. Why would she that. want to live in the Gulch near Barry's Boot Camp and Lululemon? Like, she's not about yeah, that. She's, she's not an about artist. That. She just wants to chill with her guitar, isn't it? Yeah, isn't it? Okay. Um, and she's in Hampstead, like, most of the time, so. Exactly. With her British boyfriend. Anyway, yeah. Joel knows everything. Um, Amanda Joe. Hi, Amanda. Have y'all um, taped? T- taped? Oh, I think she means like film. I love that. You said tape. Oh, so iconic. Amazing. Have you all taped from the walking bridge? What's no, but the we saw, remember bridge? the one we remember when we walked past the Hard Rock Cafe? That's gotta be the walking bridge. Oh, hasn't maybe, it? yeah. It's it, really pretty during the day and night and it's very iconic. It's also perfect for a cover photo. Okay. Thank you, Amanda. That's we'll double check what bridge that is, but yeah, it must be that one. That's um, the only bridge we've seen that's yeah. massive. Mm-hmm. I imagine that you've probably got views of the strip. Yeah, that'd night, be nice. like all the lights. That's yeah. pretty cool, isn't it? Alex Hunter Hi, Flakey. Alex. Oh, oh, Alex. Alex. Have to work at 4 30 a.m. Much love. Oh no, oh, Alex. Alex, sleep well, darling. darling. Have a kiss from Joe and Leah. Mm. Oh, two she sides. Got two two sides. Wow. It's the Mediterranean way. Yeah. Okay, darling. Um, let's just go back up because now we've lost our place because Alex. Oh, everyone's leaving. It's really upsetting. Mm-hmm. Look. Everyone's going. How, oh, we're so far what, behind. Are you joking? This is how far behind we are. This is a joke. Sorry, guys. We need to speed up. Oh, my gosh. We're so behind. Okay. okay. We're going to have a really quick super chat speed we're through. We're going to make this a speed Let's through. Let's just speed through, and then we get okay. back onto our stories. Rod, Rod Westwood. Westwood. The Cuban coffee is an espresso that's whipped with sugar and a bit of milk. It's Ooh. a bit thick, delicious. Also, try a traditional flan. Oh, so I've had a whipped coffee. I think we, yeah, you made me a whipped coffee as well. Yeah, I, I guess there's probably many different cultures that go like who yeah. coined the whipped coffee. Everyone thing. thinks they invent everything. Yeah, Greeks have been doing like Greeks and Cypriots have been doing like freddo espresso or frappe for years. Yeah. So I would just say that they did it, but then everyone does it. Well, in lockdown, whipped coffee was a real trend, and so yeah, I've I had some whipped coffee. I've had whipped coffee at yours. Mm. Yeah, we'll definitely try that. Okay. Right, Lisa, Lisa Fleury. Fleury, late fees. So looking forward to the rest of the Toronto series and all the USA vids. Oh, my so exciting. Much. There's so much content. We might just dip back and forth. Like, here's a Toronto video. Here's a Miami video. Here's a this video. Here's a... Like, yeah. we might just dart about just to yeah. keep it fresh and exciting. Yeah, Do you know what I fresh. mean? Keep it fresh. I like Joel's idea as well. Hi, we're John Lear. We're in... Insert name here and then get on with the video. Good idea. Kelly Hughes. Hi, Hi, Kelly. Kelly. Did you go to the Parthenon in Centennial Park? It's a must-see in Nashville. Have a Prosecco on me. Yeah, so we did. Thank you so much, Kelly. We were on the uh, Hop On Hop Off bus. So we went through it and like we the bus sort of stopped there for a bit and we were like taking content and then it just we heard the stories about and then we carried on. But we didn't get off and stay in the park, although it did look very beautiful. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm sure there's probably more to do, like going inside it. There's yeah. loads of art inside, apparently. Yeah. Um, sorry, that just made me laugh. I was in Nashville in June. The smell was awful. It's hysterical. Rainbow Owl. Hi, Rainbow Owl. You're welcome. No problem. Oh, that was the email. Yeah. Disney actually requires park reserve in advance now, so the email had links for that. Dining res info, planning app, and magic bracelets, Genie Plus, I and Lighting this Lane now. info, Michael sent dollar for tips, etc. Lightning Lane. I remember about the Lightning yeah, Lane. Yeah, I remember this. 
Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah we've we'll definitely go got through. that one. Thank we need you. to make that priority to get these bookings. We've been so busy with this Nashville series that we haven't had time to sit down and plan for Orlando. But... Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, Joel. Yes, 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 Leah. Nachos, 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 nachos. Nachos, nachos. I was just about to say, did we order something for the flat tonight? Or did we abandon no, the we car? we abandoned it. Okay, because that, for some reason, Rainbow Owl made me think How do you of... not remember that? I think you've cancelled the order on your phone. Oh, I think you cancelled it for me. Oh. Okay, anyway, anyway, anyway. M- MK! Hi, Hi MK. MK! Memphis is sketchy, sketchy, so be careful going there. Well, we're not going there, but one day we'd like to, just purely for Graceland. Yeah. Um, um, that would be cool, but we didn't know it was sketchy. I mean, everywhere's got, like, you know, some sketchy... Everywhere's got a sketchy bit. I had it? a message from someone being like, be very careful in Tennessee. It's not a safe state right now. I was yeah. like, way to instill fear in us. I don't need any more of that. Honestly, legis- health and safety's health got and safety. it already. Like, ask him anything, he can tell you the yeah, response. Literally. Greg Lugo. Hi, Greg. Hi, Greg. Joel, Joel love, love the, the tap. tap. Thank Bad you. Boy. So creative. It is. So, question for both of you. Do you ultimately think you'll visit all 50 states or is that possibly the goal? Well, that, you know what? Pre COVID, we actually said we'll do all 50. Yeah. We probably. Probably will. Yeah. We might aim for all 50. I think we could. If we, we can do 50. like, ultimately, I think we could do four trips to the USA a year, yeah. max probably. But like, I know, so I know that would take time, but actually, it's that worth would it. Be so it's fun. Worth it. Like, when are you going to do that in your life? Like, you just got to make the time to have, like, yeah. make it happen. And this won't last forever. Like, yeah, exactly. They're, we're, they're, like, we can't be doing this forever, so we might as well do it while we're young, baby. <laughs> Exactly. Which we keep getting ID'd and I love it because oh that God. means they think we're 21. Every time we walk into a honky tonk and they're like, ID, and you're yeah. like, sorry, this is hysterical. Sorry, we're so... I'm just waiting though when we show them our ID for them to go like, gosh, you're 30. <laughs> wow, you don't look it, but no one said that yet. No, because they're not used to the British ID, so they look at it for a really long time trying to find the date of birth. Yeah. It's iconic. New, New member. member. Oh, actually, Sherry um, Witten. Yes, yeah, Sherry Witten. Thank you, Sherry. Um, new member Rainbow, Rainbow Owl. Owl yes definitely would love to see Joel and Leah in Nashville Parthenon maybe that could be a Leah channel video by the way did you go to Greek Town in Toronto thank you Rainbow Owl um, yeah I mean we could try and go back I don't know if our tickets are valid again to get on that hop on hop off we might just try it they didn't scan it they just looked at it so yeah. we could try and just go back there be fraud legends be but... fraud legends um, but yes and then Greek Town Toronto no we didn't go but potentially so you did do a Greek video did do a Greek video tried a few Greek foods but not from that area and I'm going to use some b-roll from a um, Johnny Walks because mm-hmm. uh, he's done walking along Danforth <laughs> Danforth Danforth so I'm just going to b-roll some of that into the video I emailed him for permission he said yes okay so moving on Lol. <laughs> <laughs> Amanda Jones. Hi, Sadly, Amanda. Amanda has to go. Oh, Amanda, stop. Also, I'm going to miss some live streams, some love streams. Send me lots of luck. We're filming a TN project we've been planning almost a year. Good, Good luck. luck. Good luck from Joel. Good luck from Leah. Have the best time. I know you're going to smash it, Amanda. That's going to be so much fun. Like, yeah. I hope it goes so well. And yeah. hopefully we'll catch up when you're back. Yeah. Okay, guys, moving on. Nutri Plant Land. Hi. Hi. Late fee, hair ties for Leah, coffee, coffee for Joel. Joel. You are welcome to our vegan Thanksgiving vegan feast if you want to come to the Gulf Coast, Fort Myers area. Wow. Thank you very much. We love vegan. We absolutely love vegan. Yeah, we actually do. That I don't know how joke. far away that is from where we're going to be, but um, yeah. thank you for the invite. We've yeah, actually you. had two invites now, so... Wow. Thank you. It seems like there's some options. Like, this is a really nice position to be in, guys. Thank you. Um, uh, Sorry, my laptop's just like, is the battery plugged in? Yes, it is. Um, Michael Battles. Hi, Hi, Michael. Michael. You should go to Taverna Opa in Orlando, (laughs) fun Greek place. Don't know how authentic the food is, but a fun atmosphere. Okay. Thank you for the suggestion. I mean... This could be, you know, trying Greek food everywhere. Around the world. Every time we do a Greek, every time we do a trip in the States, we'll just make sure to drop by a Greek place. That's quite fun. Thank <laughs> As you, Michael. As if that's the only thing about your personality. I know, imagine. <laughs> Hair um, ties and Greek. 
Oh my gosh, <laughs> yeah. What was the hair ties for? Is it because I always go like that? Or because yeah. I always twizzle them around twizzle my hands? Twizzle them, maybe. Thank you, Michael. Um, okay, so elect eclectic jellyfish hello leah has me buying terry's for live stream oh my god they're so expensive here like what are you doing yeah, it wasn't in Canada. yeah it was actually atrocious That's i'd awful. never paid more than a pound um also i was cracking up earlier imagining you guys giving taylor swift a medal <gasps> we actually should <laughs> taylor Imagine. if you're watching medal medal what will we be stunning. giving her a medal for? Just being her just queen, being queen Taylor. Taylor. She gets a knighthood. Just for being the best female recording artist of all time. Absolutely iconic. Um, Karen Rudd. Hi, Kaza. Hi, Karen. Have, Have you, you tried, tried real, real southern, southern sweet, sweet iced tea? tea? Also, while you're in the USA and staying in Catch Benedict Cumberbatch in Sea Below. Can you also why stay in the USA and staying in? Ca Staying in, oh, staying stay in, in comma, Catch Benedict Cumberbatch in Sea Below. Below. Okay, cool. We'll okay. have to check out Sea Below. Okay. We have not um, tried real southern sweet tea. It's not really my thing. I don't really like iced tea. I don't like drinking things with sugar in them. I just drink all of the crap that's in diet drinks, like additives and sweeteners. Yeah. So um, if they did a diet sweet iced tea, I would. Okay. I, I doubt that exists. I, I do quite like a sweet drink. You had a lemonade um, today. Uh, today I had a homemade lemonade in the hat. Is it Hattie's? Hattie Bees. Hattie Bees. And I thought it was delicious. Yeah. It was so nice. You could tell it was it was so like, it was so lemony, so sugary. It tasted like a lemon drizzle in a drink. It was stunning. Lovely. Um So yeah, I mean, I'd, I'd be up for trying some sub, real southern sweet iced tea. Yeah, I'd be up for that. Um, I'd try it if one of the legends made it for us, but I don't yeah. want to go to the supermarket and buy one. No, no, that wouldn't be like legit enough, nah, would it? Nah. Um, Thomas Richards. Hi, Thomas Hi, Richards. Thomas. Dana says, if you don't join a family for a traditional Thanksgiving whilst you're in the US, <laughs> I'm seriously going to cry. Thank you. Oh, uh, well, you. we'll see. We can't make any promises. Security is like, well, are we going to get murdered? So, um, but yeah, we'll see. We'll yeah. see. We'll do some background security checks. That'd be, it'd be really fun. And yeah. Joel, Joel's on security. Yeah. So uh, We'll have to have a code yeah. word if we need to leave as well. <laughs> What's it going to be? Code word could be... Me legend. Me legend. Me legend, me legend. Joel, <laughs> Joel excuses us from the table by going, me legend. And then like <laughs> curtsies and walks out. Oh uh, my gosh. Karen, Karen. The electrical life of Louis Wayne showing up. Oh, I thought it was called Sea Below, but you meant Sea Below. Yeah, I, 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 I understood her Sea Below, but then you were like, no, I haven't seen Sea Below. And I was like, maybe Joel's seen the trailer and I haven't. And maybe uh, I was Well, because I just thought, why was it not all in one super chat? Uh, maybe that's but, the maximum. No, we've seen longer yeah, we've messages, seen longer. haven't we? Maybe Karen's just super generous and wanted to donate twice. Oh, I Karen, love that. Karen, so kind. Thank you, Karen. Thank you. Um, so showing on Prime TV, movie will premiere in the UK theatre, UK theatres in Feb. Mm -hmm. Fab movie, Academy Award worthy in my opinion. Okay. Oh, lovely. That'd be nice. Yeah, it'd be nice Thank to have you. an evening in. Oh, like in Orlando, nice. we will have a bit of a rest because this trip has been crazy, and Miami's only going to get crazier. I think. Yeah, so. I can tell you're exhausted right now. You're, oh, yeah. I'm ready to off. go home. To be fair. Yeah. Like. This trip is so long, and we always knew this because we both like being at home. We we get homesick, so obviously loving being in Nashville, but like, um, yeah, like in terms of being homesick, I'm like, ah, oh, two weeks would have been enough. <laughs> yeah, Brit Brat. Hi, Brit Brat. Oh, Leah, you get the f what does that say? Frisons, frisons, easy. easy. So, what's frisons? I'm not sure actually. Um, frisons. I'll Google that one. Thank you, Brit Brat. Appreciate that. Mm. Um, Kevin Rainey, new member. New member. Oh, Welcome, Kevin. Eight new members on this live stream. Incredible. Hope you enjoy. Alina Doll, um, Thanksgiving live stream. It will be the best birthday ever. Aww. Cannot wait until you get to Seattle. Check out online glamping at Pampered Wilderness in Miller, Sylvania State Park. It's gorgeous. Thank you, Alina Doll. That sounds fun. That sounds fun. Online and glamping. Yeah, I know. Oh, check out online glamping at Pampered. Yeah. We could do glamping. We probably couldn't do camping. Yeah, we glamorous could camping. Do glamping. Glamping, that's right up our street. Yeah. Absolutely. New, New member. member. Both M. Dunseith. 
and, and Lucy, Lucy Lulu Lucy, 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 Oh, oh, my computer's just no. done the thing. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm just going to have to scroll up. It does this thing where it just jumps to the end. Um, in Infomercial break by Joel. Hi, guys. I'm Joel, and this is Leah. It's just Joel and literally, literally Leah, Leah, and we're going to catch up with your comments any moment now. Okay, so um, author Lisa has come on. Lisa, who yeah. happens to be an author. Um, I've been following for a while now. Hello. Um, you're so entertaining and I'm certain you're amazing humans. Mm. If I were your parent, I would be so proud of you both. Thank, Thank you. you. That's so Thank kind. you, author Lisa. I think all of our parents are proud of us. Absolutely. Aren't they? So proud. Yeah. It's just a lovely feeling. It's it nice is. to have supportive parents. Very lucky. Thank you so much. Thank you. Are we still in Nash Vegas? We absolutely we are. Absolutely Nash are. Vegas. We love Nash it's Vegas. even better than Smashville. Yeah. It's funny because we thought we thought we coined the term Smashville. So disappointing. And then we went somewhere today. We were walking towards the gorge. And Don't breathe in that burp. <laughs> yeah. And we saw Smashville and we like, we didn't. Because I was like, let's go out and smash Nashville, meaning smash the Nashville suit. It's gone now. Yeah, but there's residue. I know how they behave, darling. They're very thick. Yeah, thick. Um, and I was like, Smashville. And then we've been saying Smashville. And then we've Saw a sign. seen a sign saying Smashville. It's devastated that we didn't coin it, aren't we? They've even got merch with Smashville on it. They've been <laughs> killing on that. Yeah. Uh, Gina Duke. Hi, Hi Gina. Gina. As you're driving to Colorado, you'll pass through... Orlando. Orlando. <laughs> <laughs> what did I say? Colorado? Mm. Colorado, yeah. I think because I might have seen a comment earlier that said Colorado and it's in my head. You will pass through Smicky Mickey. Smoky Mountains. Smoky Mountains. It's the abbreviations for me. And Dollywood. Oh, we're actually not driving to we're Orlando. Not. We're taking no. a flight on Saturday or Sunday. Yeah. Saturday, I think. Yeah. So, oh, I'm terrified about driving. So, like, yeah. there's no way we would drive that far. Yeah, <laughs> it's already terrifying to Orlando. enough driving around Orlando. Yeah. Um, but yeah. hey. We'll vlog it and... No, we, no you said we're not vlogging in the car. Well, we need to vlog, but not on the first trip. We can vlog. Okay. Brit drives up. You, they they want to see me driving. I'll like just... Us driving. I also want to film you driving on a quiet road. I'm not I'm not doing that. Okay. I'm not allowed. Oh, why? Not allowed. Why? I'm not allowed to drive. I'm not a confident driver. You are allowed to drive. It's yeah. Whether you want to drive I choose not. not to drive. Okay. Yeah. So, I um, don't think that's a good idea. Okay. I don't think I'll be getting insured on the car either. Well, you can't, well, as in, like, the insurance is included. So, when you go, like, they just take the licenses of anyone who wants to be on the car. Do they give you them back or do they just hold on to them? No, they just photocopy them. I photocopy them. Mm. Okay. Um, okay, so, just, we're nearly caught up. Kevin said, so surreal, y'all, in my hometown. At work right now, sneaking so I won't get caught on my phone. Oh, love y'all. Big love from Nashville. Thank you, Kevin. So sweet. Um, I hope you, because we're so late reading this, I hope you've seen it if you sneak, you know, sneakily on your phone. But maybe yeah. you catch it on, on replay later yeah. on. Yeah. And, uh, oh, oh, dear. And then Geesey said, make sure you go to the legendary milkshake bar in Nashville. Oh, we Don't haven't seen, seen that. We would have remembered that because the word any anytime we see the word legend, we're always like, legends. Mm. Like we always clock it. So we haven't definitely have haven't see seen it. that. Look out for that. We're Thank not very you. good at going off the beaten track though. We normally have stuck to Broadway, but that's why today's been really nice because the bus tour has taken us places we wouldn't have gone otherwise. Yeah. But I think tomorrow also we're gonna go to Twelve South or whatever it's called. Um, someone recommended that to us and apparently it's a, like a little bit of a drive away so we'll get an Uber but it's um, like a bit more bougie place where there's nice little independent shops and there's restaurants and stuff um, yes yeah. so we'll give that so a go we'll tomorrow and um, then finally Lord of the Pringles hi, hi Lord, Lord of, of the Pringles, Pringles. thank no you for message, joining but lovely donation so thank you Lord of Pringles yeah um an absolute hoot it's been tonight, guys. It has. Absolutely amazing. Do you need an international driver's license to drive here? No, you just need a British driver's, driver's license. license. Yeah, that's why it's scary because it's like no one trains you. Like when you rent a car in America, they don't say, by the way, here's how test. to drive in America. 
they just like trust that you can do it. They don't make you do like a little obstacle course first, like no. where you just sort of go around a bit of a fake track. No, no. as if no. imagine if they make would they do that no. anywhere else? That would be fun. No. They've got the space for it. They could do it. They could. They could do put it. a car park where they're like, hey, everyone on this works here, and this is a trial. It'd take too much time. It would, wouldn't it? The queues for the cars at the airport is ridiculous, and really? sometimes they run out of cars as well. So that's why we need to book. Okay. Because otherwise we won't be getting around anyway. Oh my gosh. We'll just spend the whole time at the house. It won't matter. It's not an Uber place, is it? It's more of a drive. No. Everyone drives. Yeah. Yeah. So it's, it's just it's too really... far. And like, because everyone lives on gated communities. Like, I don't know how the Uber would get into the community. Yeah. There. It just would, would drop it far away from... Mm. Okay. Okay, guys. Um... Right, I think we'll, we'll wrap, wrap it up, up there. here, guys. We've been on for an hour and 20. It's been really fun, as always, chatting. Oh, just quickly, Lord of the Pringles just coming with a message. When you're in Orlando, check out Celebration Florida, the town Walt Disney. Oh, but Celebration Florida, the town Walt Disney created. They have an amazing pub. They have you do. Been there? Oh, I've been there loads. I'm taking Leah. We're going to go on a bike ride around there. We'll probably go to Columbia, which is one of the restaurants there. She'll love the bread really fluffy warm bread. bread and they do amazing caesar salads oh i and then love bread we'll probably go to the tavern there or the boston restaurant which is really nice yes um, so yeah lots to do and just classic as soon as we start rounding things off randomly <laughs> super chats start coming in so thank you jen um hi native texas living in utah here this this is your <laughs> just my voice <laughs> This is your sweet tea. Just do it, Joel. You only live once. I'll be in the UK for a month in June. Oh. Can't wait. What town do you recommend? Well, mm. I don't know. I'm biased. I'd say London, but everyone goes there. Um, town. Manchester's really fun. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know. Bristol. I like Bristol. And Bath. Bath is really historic. That's cute. And like, they've got the nice Roman baths. Yeah. Uh, they've got a great fudge shop there. Um, yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much, Jen, for that. That's lovely. And um, yeah, if I try sweet tea, I'll just, I'll give Joel a sip, see if I'll he likes sip, it. Sip, sip. He'll have a sip. Yeah. Um, I've just tried Lipton's iced tea in the past and I just didn't like it, so. Imagine. They do like their homemade and we're yeah. like, Lipton's iced tea. Lipton's, nah. <laughs> yeah. Um, okay, guys, will there be a vlog after this live stream? Not tonight. Tomorrow, Tomorrow night, night there will be yes that will be the Niagara Falls video it's a very good one so stay um, tuned for that yeah finally doing something cultural people are like I can't believe you went to Ni you went to Toronto and didn't do Niagara Falls I yeah was like, <sighs> Joel is at the end of his yeah at yeah. the end of it at the end, end of, of it. it end of it guys how many times do you have to tell people clearly hundreds hundreds before oh, the message that, I know no. I burped and oh it smells God. I burped and it smells. It's that's the, what it felt like. It's the chicken. Yeah, that it's was the, the that, medium I, chicken that, that I should have eaten. Yeah, I just did a chicken burp. That's disgusting. That's right. At least we're best friends, so okay, it's fine. It's fine. Thank you guys for the live stream. Everyone's really thankful. So thank you guys. It was like the, I don't know, 15th live stream we've done. So Crazy. exhausted legends are going to go to bed and we will see you tomorrow. See you soon, Everyone guys. Everyone out, guys. Lots of love. Yes. Yeah, Take you care. Soon. Bye. Bye.